Suicide could be described as the act of taking one's life either by hanging or consumption of deadly substance, among others. According to statistics, the number of people who die by suicide has continued to rise in this part of the world, and their reasons range from hardship and hunger, frustration, among others. Speaking on the development, the vicar of St. Paul's Anglican Church, Umu Walker, Reverend Canon Uchenna Umi Fekwem, regretted the continuous rise of suicide cases in today's society, identifying pride, hopelessness, lack of trust in God for a better tomorrow as some of its remote causes. Reverend Canon Umi Fekwem further highlighted bad leadership and unemployment amongst youths as other major causes of such an ill action saying that in order to minimize or eradicate such, leaders will learn to address problems bordering the subjects and governments must create job opportunities for youths. Psychologists uh, have said that uh, depression is the major cause of uh, suicide in the society because, you know, somebody takes his life, taking his own life. It means that all that, that person is despondent. It means that all hope is lost. It means that that person has tried with the best of his ability to make sure that he better a particular situation that he finds himself, but is not forthcoming. The General Superintendent of Redeemed Covenant Church, Oka, Pastor Kenneth Mozier attributed it to deterioration of family values as according to him, parents no longer inculcate right attitudes and belief in their children as their business or work is now more important to them than their family responsibilities. Family system is one of the issues, the failure of parental failure. Then you come to the, the society at large, the value system has been distorted. So we are giving the youth these days the impression that money is all things. And when some of them cannot get money, they feel that is the end of their life. On his part, the head of psychology department in Namde Azikiwe University, Oka, Professor Harry Obimosu, who is also the head psychological services center of the institution, observed that less attention is given to mental health in Nigeria and made a case that as health is in the recurrent list, state governments should give more attention to primary health and psychological centers should be provided in all general hospitals for mental care of the citizenry. As according to him, mental imbalance could lead to suicide. Uh, we need to address health the way it should, not just physical health, but also mental health, and understand that if we do not attend to medical health, I mean to our mental health, physical health may also suffer. Also speaking, an Oka resident, engineer Gerald Dulu, called for aggressive campaign by the government and the media against the act to discourage people from seeing it as a way to end problems, saying that no problem or challenges of life is worth dying for. Suicide is not a solution to life challenges or problems. For this reason, let us boldly face our life challenges and problems hoping and trusting in God for a better tomorrow. I am Emmanuel Okonkwo, reporting for ABS News.